Tuangazie tamaduni za wachina ambapo Kenya na China zinaweza kutumia utamaduni wao kuimarisha uhusiano baina yao kulingana na mkurugenzi wa taasisi ya Confucius ya Chuo Kikuu cha Nairobi Profesa Wang Shangshu uh, nchi hizi mbili uh, zinaweza pia kutumia utamaduni wao kwa maendeleo ya kiuchumi alisema haya wakati wa sherehe za mwaka mpya za China zilizoandaliwa katika chuo kimoja cha kibiashara cha Nairobi na jinsi Pauline Nasimiu anavotoarifu tamasha hizo ziliwaonyesha wa Kenya utamaduni wa wachina tizama Mapambo ya kupendeza ya wachina vyakula na furaha kwenye nyuso za wachina kunaashiria matarajio yao ya mwaka wao mpya Huku wachina kote duniani wanaposherekea mwaka wao mpya kulingana na kalenda yao wachina wanaoishi Kenya hawakuachwa nyuma Sherehe hizo zilikuwa na shughuli nyingi zikiwemo densi maarufu ya wachina kuandika maandishi ya Kichina na michezo ya kitamaduni ya Wachina zilitumiwa kama vivutio kwa Wakenya kushuhudia tamasha za mwaka mpya wa China. We create a kind of a Chinese uh, fair uh, to the local people and uh, let them to eat the Chinese food and uh, to see the, to experience Chinese culture to write some calligraphy to write a fu fu means a kind of a good fortune. Vyakula vitamu vilipakuliwa na kulikuwa na chakula maalum ambacho kila mchina alikula wakati wa tamasha hizo. We also have another food which is called dumpling, dumpling jiaozi, jiaozi because during Chinese New Year uh, everyone eat jiaozi, eat jiaozi. So it's a kind of like a, you know the ancient ancient money, you know the shape like the ancient money means in the year you can gain more money. Kulingana na kalenda ya China mwaka 2023 ni mwaka wa sungura na ina maana maalum ya kale. Rabbits represent a kind of a wisdom and also the peace. Uh, so we uh, want to wish the happy Chinese rabbit year to all the Kenya people. Utamaduni huo wa China unatumiwa kuwafahamisha wa Kenya kuhusu uzuri wa utamaduni wa China. Because of culture we can get a better understanding uh, if we get a better understanding that can tie up us uh, tie up between Chinese people and Kenyan people Tamasha hizo zinaendelea kwa wiki mbili Pauline Nasimi Derubini Weekend